Thanks, Rita. I oh, no. Sorry, that's sort of frowned upon here. Oh, right. You two can hold hands, though. <laughs> How are you, Elena? Good, thanks. You, uh, you look great. So, against my better judgment, these permits will get you through most checkpoints. Okay, great. Oh, and I shouldn't be worried about what's in those bags, right? <laughs> of course not, no. Yeah, <laughs> not yet, anyway. <laughs> All right, remember, you're journalists now. So try and act respectful. Think you can handle that? I think she's talking to you. <laughs> so what exactly are you two reprobates up to? Uh, just a little historical research. Right, so that explains the big rush. Exactly. No cursed treasures? Nope. No diabolical warlords? No. You are the worst liar. What? You are. Oh, come on, we're not going to start Excuse this, me. are we? Just the car, where is it? Oh, it's over there. Oh, just take the bags and meet you. Nate. You're still wearing it. I, yeah, I am. Mm -hmm. It helps in this part of the world. Oh, really? Seriously? Don't flatter yourself. I see you're still wearing yours. What? Oh, oh, yeah. That's what this is all about, isn't it? You don't understand. I, I finally proved it. Drake lied about his route to the East Indies. 400 years ago, he came here. Why, Nate? That's what we're here to find out. No, I mean, why this obsession? I'm, I'm just worried. I can take care of myself, all right? Not talking about you. <laughs> what, Sully? He would go to the ends of the earth for you, Nate. Just don't ask him to. Come on, that's not fair. What is that even supposed to mean? What's that? <laughs> you could just drop us at the edge of the city, that'd be great. Not a chance. You two are my responsibility now. I'm not taking my eyes off of you. Down there. Those buildings would have been hundreds of years old, even when Francis Drake was alive. All right. Good thinking. Hey. Hey. Huh. Talbot. Who? He's got Cutter's notebook. What? Wait, what? Charlie Cutter? Yeah. No time. Sully can explain everything. Hey, wait a minute. Meet you down there. Alone, could you? Come here. Not a complete loss. Get me. Hey, you boys. Somebody can fill me in here. Who are those guys? And what does Charlie have to do with all this? He was working with us on this one. Wait, what was? He's not dead. No, no. Him and Chloe. Wait, Chloe too? Yeah, but they both bowed out when Cutter broke his leg. He broke his leg? <laughs> He's lucky he didn't break his damn neck and fall like that. He's fine. Because between that and burning to death, I think I would have jumped too. Not helping. 
All right, just tell me what you're really looking for. Uh, this? <laughs> Come here. Sully, check this out. We've lost him. What do you got? It looks like we stumbled right into our secret entrance. Well, that's our girl. Well, not going down there without some hardware. Go talk to that rug merchant we just passed. Oh, my guns, weapons. He's not really a rug merchant. Oh, <laughs> right. Hey, just uh, watch yourself out there, okay? Yeah. All right, Seriously, what is all this crap Nathan, you're giving you me about Sully? With me? Those guys are not here for historical research, and neither are you. This, this is about that Marlo woman, isn't it? Yes, but look at this. I finally got it. And it's just like I said. That led to this. This led us here. To a hole in the ground. Well, it's a glamorous life. Come on, admit it. You love all this as much as I do. No. No, not anymore. Really? Huh. Okay, well, why don't you just uh, walk away? Oh, me? Me walk away. <laughs> That's funny. Shotguns? Why not? That's it. Come on, you only had two. Great. All right, just give me a hand with this. All right, ready? <laughs> well, well, well. <laughs> uh, it's cute. What? Because it's so well. Shall we? Hey guys, secret entrance to what? What's down there? Only one way to find out. Another non-answer. <laughs> you expected something different? <clears throat> All right, we're good. Come on down. Just a cistern, kid. You sure this is the right place? Yeah, it's, it's gotta be. So what was Sir Francis doing all the way out here anyway? He was on a secret expedition to Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, to find the lost city of Ubar. Yeah, the Atlantis of the Sands. Under this city. No, 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 it's in the middle of the Ruble Kali Desert. This place just tells you how to find it. so sure that it's treasure they're after? Not really sure, no. Okay, all the floating body parts? This is giving me the creeps. You better get up here. I'll go check it out. Sully, throw me your lighter. All right, coming at you. Okay, so that didn't work either.
Come on. Okay, so Nate, did Francis Drake ever find that lost city that he was looking for? Don't think so. Seems like he only came this far, then turned back and headed home. And concealed everything about this little detour. Yeah. Have you stopped to ask yourself why? What do you mean? I don't know. This whole place just seems like some kind of a... a warning to me, that's all. Huh, it looks like some kind of ornate brazier. Sully, this is some kind of celestial map. That makes sense. The Arabs used the stars to navigate the desert just like sailors on the ocean. That's right. So you could use these constellations to find the site of the lost city. If I had a sextant, sure. Couldn't do all that time in the Navy for nothing, you know. <laughs> I hear I thought you spent the whole time looking for that basket act. The what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> hey, you think you could remember this? Oh, yeah, but you ought to copy it down, don't you think? Uh, no, I really don't recommend that. Hey guys, look at this. Huh. Well, that's, uh, cheery. Do you hear that? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Wait, what is that? Get away from the walls. Hold on to that torch, kid. Oh, my God. 